Tim Hortons is an iconic fast food chain with over 5,200 locations in 14 different countries. But did you know the restaurant's namesake, Tim Horton, only made $1 million off the business? NHL Hall of Famer Tim Horton opened the first Tim Hortons Donuts in 1964 under a licensing deal with businessman Jim Charade. But Horton parted ways with Charade that year and struck a 50-50 ownership agreement with one of his franchise owners, Ron Joyce. Fast forward 10 years, in 1974, the two had opened 33 Tim Hortons Donuts and another 15 were under construction. But on February 20th, 1974, Tim Horton died in a car crash after playing a hockey game in Toronto. And following his death, Ron Joyce negotiated with Tim Horton's wife, Lori, to buy 100% of the Tim Horton's business. The price? $1 million and a Cadillac Eldorado. Ron Joyce then rapidly expanded the franchise over the next 20 years. And in 1995, Wendy's bought it for $600 million. Lori Horton ended up suing Ron Joyce in the late 1980s to get back the 50% of the business that she sold. But she would ultimately lose, while Ron Joyce built up a net worth of $1.4 billion before passing away in 2019.